Okay, we're on the road. We are in Wales and we are heading to Swansea. Let's see what the offering is like. Carlos, hello. Okay. I'm Adam. Pleased to meet you. Are you well? Thank you very much. Okay, so you're about to head into your press conference. Do you prepare like you do for a match or not? Or do you have a more relaxed feeling? I don't prepare my, my press conference because, uh, again, I'm, I, I, all the time I follow my instinct. Uh, I was uh, working in Portugal, in Turkey and Greece. And I don't know if you know about that, but there the, the, the press is very aggressive. Mm -hmm. So when you survive, in this kind of press conference, you are ready to everything. It's a lot more entertaining for us in here when you hear some of the lines he comes up with. I mean, one we can talk about lobsters, sardines, then dogs in a house. Met the metaphors just won't stop. Like, we're looking forward today to see what he'll say next. How have you managed to get the players on board and loving life once again? Football is a systemic, uh, complex, complex phenomenon. So uh, everything is connected. So it's not just about uh, the the new formation, the tactics, the strategy, the trainings. Also, is your behavior. Also, is the way that you communicate with them. Also, is the way that you uh, put them believe in you or not, because it's crucial. Have you noticed that there's been a, a few managers over the past 12 months, 18 months, that some have enjoyed this experience far more than others? I think does it. It, it does come down to each individual manager, but Carlos seems to enjoy it. In fact, he seems to love it, um, which is fantastic from the club's perspective. It makes our life a lot easier. When you step into that, that news conference and you sit behind the microphone, we've seen you play a couple of games before and, and uh, you, you said some guy had, a, had some food, oh, uh, food yeah. on his cheek, which is nice. It just puts everyone at ease. Is that, is that a way that you'd like to, like to play it? Can, can be like that or can be uh, something that I try to explain and after instead I, I talk 20 minutes to answer one question, maybe with analogy, like I did one or two times, that uh, in 30 seconds the people understand exactly what I want. If, if me and you, you go to a picnic and if you bring one chicken, at the end, if I eat all the chicken and you don't eat nothing, statistical, you eat half chicken. <laughs> Correct? Correct. So, <laughs> half a chicken. Can you make any make any sense of that? I didn't make much sense of it, no. But I, if there was a chance to go on a picnic with Carlos Cavajal, I would be there first in the queue. Thank you very much. Thank you. Cheers. Thank you. Thank you very much. I've got an analogy for you. Yeah. You're a swan because you're serene and calm on the top, and it seems as if you're just paddling, paddling, paddling very, very well underneath. Do you, do you accept that analogy that Carlos Cavalial is, is basically a swan and you're in the perfect place? Yeah, absolutely. Nice. It's a good analogy. Exactly. Yeah, because the people are just looking to the snow, the, the swan, but they are not uh, looking too much to the, the things that are putting the, really the, 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 the swan to move. I don't mind that continues to do, to do in this way. Um, and let's see if we achieve, uh, we put the, the boat in the good port, is what we want. We wish you well, thank you very much for your Thank time. You very much. Thank you. Cheers. Take Thank care, you good much. luck. Thank you. See ya. Yeah.